aliens. Hey, the ground is moving. The planet's gonna eat us. We have to get back to the ship right now. Then let's get the heck out of here. Oh no, the control panel's not working. We're stuck in the middle of nowhere. Hold on. Let me just give you a hand. <laughs> It's just me, Captain Spirit, who can bend all matter to his will. I did it. I still got the power. Now I just need to make a cool costume for Captain Spirit. I gotta have a cool cape to fly. Good thing I have one. Mask or no mask? No mask. Secret identity or not? Hmm. Yep, looks cool so far. Let's see. What about the armor? Cool. Should he be dark or colorful? Beware, Mantroid. Watch out. Captain Spirit is ready for battle. Every superhero team needs a supervillain team. Watch out, supervillains. Today I make my own superhero costume. Man, I wanted to go to that. But Dad had to watch the playoffs. I can take the pain. At least I don't have to use any needles. You can't win this battle, Noctarius! It's already over, Power Bear! Cool. Don't let Mantroy control you! Nobody controls me! Mantroy is my leader! And he wants you to die! <laughs> Give up now! We don't have to fight! You're not the boss of me, Power Bear! You have amazing powers. 
Why don't you join our team? Join Captain Spirit? Are you serious? He's my enemy! Only because Mantroid brainwashed you. You can help the world with us. Liar! Where were you and Captain Spirit when Mantroid saved my life? Huh? Good guy? Shut up! How many times do I have to stop you? Until you do stop me! I can't defeat Nocturius on my own! I can't! Captain Spirit! Release him, Power Bear. Oh, yeah. Captain Spirit's got your back, loser. He decided to spare you. That's a real hero. Now go back to your master. Me and Troid will get his revenge. For me! Thank you for keeping me from the dark side, Captain. Chris! Breakfast! Be right there! Captain Spirit doesn't eat weapons. But just in case. I've read this one so many... I miss Hal. He feels like he's so far away, even though he lives on the other side of town. I can't wait to go back inside the Flying Fortress. This is Chris to the Flying Fortress. Come in, come in! Roger, I'm here. I hope so, Sky Pirate. What do you see up there? Have you spotted Snowmancer? Not yet. It's hard because of the storm. This is perfect cover for a Snowmancer sneak attack. I sharp. Keep me posted. Yes, sir. Roger that. <sighs> Thanks, Sky Pirate. Over and out. I know you're out there, Snowmancer. Chris. I mean now. I miss playing ball with my friends before we moved. Hey, Spider Baby, I think you caught your lunch in your web. And there's a snail moving so fast, he's in one place. <laughs> hmm, this is a perfect day to watch Frozen. Last time Dad told me not to sing along so loud. Mom bought me so many cool comic books. She told me never throw them away. I won't. Ooh, the shark stinger is looking for victims. Look out! Here comes the evil car! That pedestrian better get out of the way. That was your last ride, Shark Stinger. Yes, Captain Spirit saved us. You'll never run over anybody again. Chris, I mean now. I know! Do not make me... Ugh, <sighs> airball. I should ask Dad to show me again. Hey, 
Chris, you better come to breakfast when I holler at you, or else we're gonna have a problem. But I... Don't. This isn't a hotel, buddy. I got things to do. What'd you expect? A waffle? It's good. Oh, you can lie better than that. Dad, I'm not lying. It's just the eggs are good. Listen, buddy, you won't hurt my feelings if you don't love my eggs. I know this doesn't compare to your mother's breakfast. You know what? I'm gonna watch some cooking shows and learn how to be a super breakfast chef. And you could be my official food taster. Deal? Yeah, okay. So, Dad, what's the big plan for today? Uh, big game plan. Even though we'll probably lose again. Gotta get rid of that coach. Today I bet we win. Now that's the fucking spirit. I'm sorry. Don't swear, okay? I don't. Superheroes don't swear. <laughs> Looks like I'm off the team. Nah. You're cool. Like a rebel. Hey, is your, uh, your arm okay? Looks better. Anybody uh, ask you about it or uh, say anything at all? No, it's fine. I worked it out. I, I just want to make sure you're okay, buddy. So, so you must be excited for Christmas. Oh yeah, are you excited too? I don't know. Santa probably put me on his naughty list this year, huh? Nah, Santa says you still get a present. What do you want? Whatever makes you happy, Chris. That's the best gift ever. Oh, since it's Saturday, are we gonna get a Christmas tree? You said we could get a real pine. Yes, I did, and yes, we are. But I just want to watch the game before we go, okay? But you always fall asleep. <laughs> I won't today. And if I do, just wake me up and we'll go. Promise. Okay. You promise? I do. Now go take advantage of your weekend. Perfect weather outside for you to play. Whatever. You're free. Come grab me later. Okay. What would Captain Spirit do? Dad took away my firecrackers when I blew up the garbage can last year. Hmm. Huh. wonder where he hid them. This isn't greedy. 
Right, Santa? Plus, Dad will love that I want basketball lessons. At least the forest warrior protect me from the snow ghost. Oh yeah, score. Dad said he was gonna fix that last month. All right. <sighs> Right. Sorry, you're too cute to fight evil. I hope I can draw as good as mom someday. The secret treasure is buried out there in the wild. Now, I have to locate the second part of the map. Are you serious? You shoot better than that guy any day. I can feel the energy flow through me. I have the power! <sighs> okay, that's a good start. But now it's time to build the rest of my costume. I could take over the town with this army. Or the world. What the fuck is this? Open your goddamn eyes! Those are goddamn carrots! Jeez, good job, chocolate hog. Playtime all the time. No superhero should wear those, but they're so comfy. What if I had real superpowers? I could protect the whole town. What kind of a Viking would I be? Ooh, now I can use that makeup from Halloween. Guess my secret identity now. One more piece and I'm almost done. I can't believe Dad let me put these stickers here. Maybe he likes them too. I never get tired of Hot Dog Man. Man, I love this issue. Wish I could draw like this. I wonder when I can start to shave. Superhero shave? Geez, where's the heat? I bet the water eater is sleeping again. Oh yeah, that's how you dominate. That's it.
Welcome to W-H-E-R-O. Today we are honored to have an interview with the world's most awesome superhero, Captain Spirit. Hello, Beaver Creek. Captain Spirit, when do you think you will defeat Mantroid? Mantroid is a bully and a coward. He can't hide, but he can run. We heard reports that he is putting together a team of supervillains. Do you have any message for them? My message is that Mantroid will never win, and I will find you, and I will crush you. Yes, that is what this town wants to hear. That's my job. And that's why we love you. Can you tell us who your superheroes are? My parents are my biggest heroes. I bet they're happy to hear that. Can you give us a hint about how you discovered your epic powers? No. Okay, do you have any final words for your audience? Be nice and always fight for the good team. Thank you, Captain Spirit, for being our hero. And now back to W-H-E-R-O News. I can't wait to get a real pine tree this Christmas. I'm glad Dad kept Mom's perfume. It smells just like her. I hope I get to go practice with Dad again this summer. I know this drawing sucks, but it's cool that Dad put it here. Light on. Yes! I'm too old to be measured now. Right? Can you get that? Now I must explore. Chris, answer the phone, please. Uh, hello? Good morning, sir. How are you this glorious day? Um, okay? Hey, who is that? Who keeps calling? I don't know. Uh, who is this? Thank you for asking, young man. My name is Derek, and I'm a proud member of the Universal Uprising Church. I'd love to tell you and your family about Jesus, our righteous Lord and Savior. Our church just wants you and your loved ones to share the Holy Spirit. Spirit? Um, we're just watching the game. Well, always remember that our Lord is watching out for you. By the way, is your mother or father available to speak? Well, I have to ask first. Chris, who the hell are you talking to? Nobody, Dad. Jesus is... Chris, these are the most important numbers for you on this list. Oh, yeah. <laughs> cool story, Dad. Careful of booby traps. Oh. My. God. Dad actually got me the new play box? No way! Dad used to always talk about this basketball. Wow. 
Dad had fans when he was playing in high school. That's scary. So we moved because Dad couldn't pay for the house? That sucks. Dad got fired? That's when he started working for the railroad. Fa la 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 la, Christmas rules, ring me the presents. Dad doesn't play Mom's records as much as before. Totally protect me from Mantroid. My suit is almost ready. After I get some pay. I love this song. I haven't listened to it since... for a long time. Long time. Hey. Hey, sports fan. You up for watching the game with your favorite MVP? Sure, Dad. How's the game going? We're kicking their asses, for once. I like it. Cool. I like it when the good guys win. Yep. Me too. You think we'll go get the pine tree? I told you right after the game. You're not gonna bug me all day, right? No. Sorry. You won a lot of games, didn't you? That's what those trophies say. That's so cool that you were a sports hero. Huh. Yeah, it was. Everybody knew my name. I wish I could have seen you in action. Here you go. Those were the good old days. Man, I hate even saying that. But they really were. Did you and Mom watch a lot of games? Oh, uh... Well, actually, she, she wasn't a big sports fan. Really? Funny, huh? But she liked to sit next to me and read. You got that from her. For sure. That's cool. What did I get from you? Hmm. Well, my hero skills, right? I get confused by basketball rules. It's like math, you know, but fun. You just have to start watching more games. Maybe we can get a basketball video game and play together. That's not exactly how you learn to play, but it's a start. Okay. I'll see you later. I'll let you watch the game now. Yeah, fine. Just get me when it's over. Uh, get ready for the tree. Can we get one that's like ten feet tall? <laughs> Only if you cut one down, Viking. We might need a bigger castle, too. Hmm. Maybe I should help Dad clean the house. Instead of playing... If 
I could go back in time, I'd go see him play. He looks so different in his basketball outfit. Dad never smiles like that anymore. Dad was so popular. I sense danger. Mantroid must be in the area. Ooh, Dad's going shopping. Let's see, what do we need? I've never seen a beaver around here. Beginning countdown to launch. Five, four, three, two, one. Can monster cannot be. Mm. Seriously? <sighs> Ugh, I hate that beer can smell. Those dishes definitely need a mega clean. Boring. Those dishes definitely need a mega clean. Now you will learn your lesson and stay clean. Snack time! Did you make that for me? You wouldn't get up during the game, so I thought you could eat out here. I can nuke this mac and cheese in no time. Not bad. Not bad at all. You better start cooking from now on, buddy. Mom made the best mac and cheese. I mean... She did make the best mac and cheese. But this is the perfect comfort food for a winter game day. Thanks. Well, taste it first. Best mac and cheese ever. Goodbye, log.
the burn. Burn. <sighs> Dinosaur Land is open for business. Eat everybody. I am more T-Rex, and you are my lunch. Dad, I found your car keys. That's where they went. I swore I had them on me, but they must have fell out of my pocket last night. Just put them in the bowl. Cool? Yeah. See what you're doing. Stop it. I don't do anything. Hmm. Let's check this out. Ooh, that looks scary. I should read that. Cheap shot! I'm going down! You can't kill the zombie jock! No way! That was a headshot! I am a super zombie! Well, I'm a superhero! Can't argue with that. Zombie down. Captain Spirit strikes back. I wonder why Dad never hangs out with Nick anymore. I wish I could have gone on a hike with Mom. This has to be Mom's. She liked art. Are you There's my hot dog man. I can't see Dad selling homes. Whoa, is he getting us tickets again? Best dad ever. That would be a blast being a freight hopper. Choo choo. Oh, those are dad's pages. Give me ref. That guy fucking carried it. Ah, I need a you pin code. What is it? I can run circles around that guy. Yes! I can hack any system! Let's start. For real? 
Boom! He's the big boss now. I would love to see Hot Dog Man team up with Captain Spirit. Yes, hell of a. Grandma and Grandpa are Dog. so cool. There's no way I'm ever leaving Dad. Closest at notebooks. Hmm, I don't think Dad reads these. I think he just no. takes them from work. You suck, boo. <laughs> How stupid are you? How can you not score here? Dad doesn't want to set up Christmas decorations yet. Makes him think I'm up. Well, that wasn't too hard. I've tamed the water beast. Hey, Dad. The water heater was down again, so I fixed it. Wow. You put it back on? Congrats, buddy. I know you hate getting in there.
Nothing can escape the deadly aim of the beer hunter. Extra bonus points on what? I can't go to Man I can't go to Mantroid's planet without finishing my costume. Box has been here forever. Now I can color Captain Spirit just like my drawing. Captain Spirit to the rescue, and it's time to visit Mantroid's home planet for a change. This is where Mom went to school before we came here. Mom didn't go to art school because of me, but she was already an amazing artist. Oh wow, I remember when Mom drew that, and Dad couldn't stop laughing. I don't get this one. I'm too young. Yes! 
Grandma and Grandpa were so nice. I wish we saw them more. Hmm. I know Dad spent a lot of money on the funeral. Oh. Now I'm ready to rock. Sorry, Dad. Mom and Dad always talked about how they met at school. It was weird having my mom as my kindergarten teacher, but fun. My first picture it looks so tiny and weird. Maybe I'm an alien baby. Here I come, man -troid. Come on, let's get going. This is Captain Spirit, you copy. Are you there, Sky Pirate? Captain Spirit, I read you loud and clear. Are you sure you want to go on this dangerous mission? Don't worry about me. man -troid is the one in danger. Gotta do a quick system check first. Instrument panel, check. Force field, check. Proton missiles, check. Escape pod, check. Windshield wipers, check. Everything looks good. Start the launch. We're going faster than light speed. What's that ahead? Oh no, meteor showers. Turn on the force field. Too late. That's the last crash landing! Ah! I wonder how many ships Mantroid has crashed on this planet. Never mind. I landed safe. Time to explore! The planet is so dark, and the sky is so red, like blood. No wonder man Troyd lives here. But how could anyone live here? It's kind of sad and lonely. What's that sound? Something is coming. Or somebody. Man Troid, show yourself, you coward! Get away from me. <laughs> I don't have to get away because I'm everywhere. Fight me instead of hiding.
can't let you live. <coughs> You will pay for what you did, Mantroid. I swear. Snowmancer, this is sad. You used to be a good enemy. Look at you now. How are you supposed to train me to fight Mandroid like that? What can we do? Now you are ready to battle with Captain Spirit. Yes! So cool! No man's here almost froze the whole city until Captain Spirit melted him. For now. Dad won't fix this wing because it's too dangerous to fix. That's Noctarius's son. He looks like his dad. Dad keeps telling me this is a girl's doll. So what? She's the Ice Queen. Sky Pirate, what's the situation since your last report? Did the storm cause any damage? No, Captain. The magnetic field protected us from any harm. We're lucky to have you. Keep up your good work. <laughs> Open sesame. I loved watching Mom draw her comics. Now I can use this to reveal the full map to my next adventure. These are my favorite baseball players, even if I don't understand the stats. Harry did say mean things about Dad, but I can't let him see this.
This is my worst report card. I'm doing better now. Well, maybe I could take one little puff. Why does he drink that if it just makes him mad? Buongiorno. Bava's Pizzeria is closed, but if you can wait, our business hours are Tuesday through Sunday, 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. If you would like to leave a message for Augusto, please do so. Pizza? Ciao. Time for Captain Spear to put these pieces together. Hmm. I have to place it right. The treasure map is not secret anymore. It's mine.
Mom was so pretty. I miss Mom's smile. Dad, you, you sleeping? Hey, wake up. Dad, come on. Huh? What? Who's there? Who's that? Dad, it, it's just me, Chris. Whoa, whoa. Hold on, buddy, okay? Jesus. I look okay? No. I tripped. Can't even watch one goddamn game. <sighs> Fuck! Uh, that's just great. Oh, I think I sprained my foot. Shit. Chris, why did you wake me up? You, you told me to wake you up. I thought... I thought you said... The pine tree? <sighs> pine tree? I can't even walk in my own house, man. You should be careful when you're... You know, when you wake up. Don't be a smartass, Chris. I'm not in the mood right now. Yeah, Dad. Okay. Jesus Christ, who is that? <sighs> Go answer. If it's some salesperson or some church group, you just close the door on them. It's nobody's business. This is our castle, and it's our family. Right? Right. Oh my, look at you. What kind of costume is that? I'm Captain Spirit. Of course you are. We need all the superheroes we can get. And how are you doing, Chris? Good, Mrs. Reynolds. Just... just... Just? Just, you know, cleaning up the house and stuff. On a beautiful Saturday like this, you should be playing instead. I even saw you clearing the snow out of the alley, so I hope you don't work all day. Well, it's laundry day. Dad's watching the game, so... That explains all the beer cans. Actually, I, I was going for a nice walk, but it sounded like the 4th of July over here. Is everything okay? Yeah, of course. We didn't hear a noise. Are you sure? Lordy, I thought, I don't know, but it was loud. And there's no other houses around. You probably heard me and my dad watching the game. He kind of go crazy, so. Hmm. You're not the only one. I must be hearing things. I hope you have something else planned for today. Oh, yeah. Me and my dad are going to go buy a real pine Christmas tree. Oh, that sounds like fun. Stephen and I better get one so we can start decorating. Oh, I love this time of year. Me too. And Dad said we could get the best Christmas tree on the lot. You certainly deserve the best Christmas tree. And if you need any extra decorations, we have a surplus. Ooh, that would be awesome. Well, I'm glad to see you're taking care of your father. Of course. We're both on the same team.
You're a good son, Chris. Listen, Chris, I'm only steps away from your house. If you ever feel scared, you can come visit us anytime, day or night. Understand? We here for you. Okay. Sure. Thanks. Thanks, Claire. I promise I'll see you later. So what did that nosy bitch want? N nothing. Oh, nothing, huh? I was listening. I heard it all. You could have gotten rid of her. I tried. Man, I bet you want to tell her what a shitty dad you have. Huh? No, she just wanted to say hi. I didn't say anything, Dad. I swear. Dad, please believe me. Jesus, stop that whining. You're not a baby anymore. Oh, boo-hoo, Daddy. Believe me. Grow up. But I... You're just... Just like your mom. Every time I look at you, I tell me you talk. Stop it. I just... I see your face. Why? And if it wasn't for you, she would have never taken the car that day. Never. Oh, hey, Chris, look, hey, I didn't mean that, buddy. Yes! Yes, you did! No, listen, Chris! 